Hey everyone, Tracy at Mystically Divine Tarot. How's everyone today? I hope you're all doing great. Welcome to my channel and welcome to today's daily tarot reading for Thursday, January 12th. Card came out before I even finished. Please remember to like this video and also to subscribe if you haven't already. I greatly appreciate it. So today we have a time to walk alone, okay? So take some time for yourself here is what I'm feeling. Take some time for yourself. Maybe get out into nature. Um, you now focus on self-love, things like that. What else today, please, for the general collective? Three of Cups, okay? So feeling, yeah, feeling like you don't want, really want to be around people, okay? I know that's, I don't really read reversals. I read intuitively, and I feel like that's the opposite meaning today. You don't really want to be around people. Yeah, no, look at this, Three of Swords as well. Yeah, you're feeling kind of heartbroken over something here, okay? Um, we'll figure out more with the clarifiers, but you're feeling a little bit heartbroken over something. You don't really want to be surrounded by people. You just kind of want to be left alone. And that's perfectly okay. Take the time you need. Yeah, wow, lots of disappointment today. Whew. Heavy energies today, guys. Four of Cups, feeling a lot of disappointment. Um, stagnancy. Hmm stuck feeling stuck king of swords hmm wanting clarity is what i'm feeling here wanting clarity about something in your life we're gonna feel figure out what that is here with the clarifiers but wanting clarity is what i'm hearing here so three of cups wanting clarity on something three of cups four of cups could be about a love situation. We have two cups energies here and a heartbreak, a heartbroken here as well. Three of cups. What's this about? Yes. Hmm. Okay. Could be about a marriage. Um, yeah. Not wanting to be around people. This could be about a marriage ending for you or someone here um, in this in your energy field. Let's see, Three of Swords, why this heartbreak? Mm, completion of a cycle, yeah. It's the completion of a cycle here with the World card. A cycle having to come to an end. It's breaking your heart, but you know it's over here is what I'm feeling. Okay, whoever this is, this could be you or someone else. I'm feeling as well. Eight of Wands, Four of Cups, you don't want to talk about it. Mm, a lot of reversals coming out today here. You're not wanting to talk to people about it. You're just kind of keeping to yourself today about it. This could be a fresh thing, okay? Fresh wound here for someone. Again, this might not be you. This could be someone you know as well. King of Swords, Wanting Clarity, Page of Wands. Excited to get clarity. Excited to get clarity on what? What are we asking for clarity on? I'm going to get more on that one, please. King of Swords, what are we asking for clarity on? Oh, chaos and conflict. Wow. Yeah, wanting clarity of the mind here. Okay, let's keep going. One more, please. What's this all about? I want to know what this, why are we in our head here? King of Swords, why are they in their head? What are they wanting clarity on? Tower and Page of Swords, wow. Hmm. They're wanting clarity on the ending. Yeah, this is something that's been in the works for a while with the Page of Swords, I feel. This ending has been coming, okay? You've been looking at, or you or someone else, I keep feeling like this could be someone else. I don't know why. So that could be resonant for someone here because I am feeling like this is someone else. Someone you know, a love interest maybe. This could be someone you're interested in. Hmm. Yeah, it could be someone you were interested in that they were married, okay? It's breaking their heart that the cycle had to end. They knew it was over. They knew it had to end here. But they're very disappointed about it. Not wanting to communicate. Wanting to be left alone. Okay, so don't force or push. If this is someone else, because I am feeling very strongly like this is someone else. 
We do have the King of Swords here, masculine energy involved here. Mm, could be Aquarius, Gemini, Libra, possibly too. I keep feeling that coming through as well. Page of Swords, Tower. Yeah, this 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 person, this masculine energy here, felt this coming, knew it was coming. Okay. It's been a long time coming, I'm hearing. But they're really wanting clarity on a situation that they know had to end, but they're wanting clarity, maybe like a why or or something. But they really want to be left alone today. So if this is someone you're interested in, guidance I would give you would be to allow this person the time they need. Okay. They really in there, they're really heartbroken and they need healing. Okay. So they need to go inward, take a walk alone. Okay. Time to walk alone. Um, and again, if this is you, then you definitely need some time to process whatever this situation is. I do feel like it could be a marriage or relationship type of thing ending for a lot of you here. Of course, only take what resonates for you. But yeah, I am feeling here that this is about a marriage or a relationship coming to an end. There is a masculine energy here that's wanting to gain clarity. I feel like maybe a why is this coming to an end? Like they knew it was over, but maybe they didn't really think that it would happen or something because the tower is about an unexpected change, right? But I mean, and, and it's also about endings. Endings bring new beginnings, but they're not in that heart space, mind space right now. They're kind of really in their head. They're hurting. Um, not wanting to communicate was what I was getting with the Eight of Wands today. Um, not wanting to be around people, wanting to be left alone to grieve, okay? So yeah, definitely um, a feeling of that today. All right, what else in love today? I feel like this is all about love here today. Um, we have this little guy here. Mm, yeah, see, they're feeling very vulnerable. Yeah, they just... Yeah, they're feeling vulnerable. They just want to, they need time and space, this person, okay? They need time and space, whether this be you or someone else. What else in love today, please? Heavy energies today, guys. Sorry, I don't sugarcoat or anything like that. If it comes through, it comes through. Uh, deep in your heart, you already know the answer. Do what feels right, okay? So deep in your heart, if you are this person, deep in your heart, you know you need the time to transform your own energy, right? To heal yourself. Deep in your heart, if this is about someone else, deep in your heart, you know that this person is hurting, healing, and needs time. So do what feels right, okay? Definitely take that guidance there. I just feel like if we were to like, in this situation for someone, if you were to like push and, and nag and things like that, they would kind of push you further away is what I'm feeling here because they really just want to be left alone. Forgive. Yeah, forgive them. Okay. Forgive them for needing that time. But in all actuality, they don't need, need forgiveness for that. They, they're entitled to that time, right? But forgive them. F see it in your heart to feel um, compassion for this person and just allow them that time that they need, right? And if this is about you, forgive yourself. You don't need forgiveness either, but forgive yourself for needing that time if that's what you feel. If you feel like guilty or whatever about it, don't feel guilty. You are entitled to take that time to heal yourself, okay? So you're not in need of forgiveness, but if you're feeling like guilty about something, forgive yourself here, okay? What else for the general collective for today, please, in love? Heavy, heavy energies. Opening to discovery. Yes. Yes. So go inward. Heal yourself and look to the positive, okay? Try to, even though it's hard, try to look to the future as a positive thing. Like, yes, this had to end in my life. I know it was over. Um, it's okay. I will be okay. Look at what the future could hold for me, okay? So look at look at things that you maybe wanted to do but never did right look at those things try to think about those things 
working towards something that you maybe were wanting in your life, okay? Opportunity, yeah, take this opportunity here. If this is you or someone else, take the opportunity to really work on yourself, okay? Don't worry about other people, okay? If someone else is vying for your attention, they should, you know, give you that time and space that you need here. And same vice versa. If this is someone else in your life that needs that time, allow them that time. Give them that opportunity to heal themselves. What else? I don't know if you can hear the doggy barks, but if you can, um, <laughs> that's Kira. Look at this. Why? Wow, spirit. Whew. Exactly what I was saying here. I told you, this person is thinking, why? Like, I knew it was over. But they they just kind of, that's what this whole Tower, Page of Swords energy here I was getting. Was they just kind of like wanting to know why. Like, they, they knew it was over, but now that it's actually happened, like, they didn't expect it. Whether this be you or someone else. It was like, it was kind of unexpected, but not at the same time. But they're still kind of wanting to know why. Yeah, wow, Spirit, thank you for that. But yeah, for sure, I was feeling that earlier. Re-energize. Yeah, re-energize yourself. Again, take the time you need, okay? Maybe self-love. Do things for yourself, right? You know, go to the spa for a day. Have your nails done. Have your hair done. Um, go to the gym. Whatever makes your heart smile. Do it for yourself, right? Do it for yourself. Re-energize yourself. You'll feel so much better. It'll, uh, it'll kind of help you rise out of this um, negative energy here. If this is you, of course. And if not, I feel like this is that per the other person that I'm feeling coming through here. This masculine energy. Because for some of you, I feel like it could be you. But for others, I feel like it's whoever this other person is. Look at this. Fate. Whatever this is that's happening, it's meant to be that way. Okay? Know that everything will work out just as it should. The universe has your back here, okay? So don't think, um, you know, anything meant for you won't pass you by. So if this person was meant for you here, if this is an ending, um, if they were meant for you, they would still be there, okay? The universe would see to it, okay? But they're, they're obviously not. It wasn't meant to be, you know what I mean? But something else will come in that is, okay? Endings bring new beginnings. So just look to the future like this opening discovery card, okay? Really look to the positive things that can come of this, okay? All right, guys. Well, that's what I have for you for today um, for Thursday. I hope this reading was helpful. If it was, please give it a like and remember to subscribe if you haven't already. Have a wonderful day and I will see you tomorrow.